I'm Victoria Hanscom and I'm the editor of Security Journal Americas and I'm here at ICUS 2024 in Las Vegas with Angelo Pianza Jr. who is the Head of Digital Access Solutions at Asa Abloy Opening Solutions Americas. So Angelo, how are you today? Doing great Victoria. So far it's a great open to the show. The hallways were very crowded. Mm. People seemed excited. Our meeting rooms are full. It's, a, full it's a good time to be in our industry, I think. Absolutely, and it's absolutely packed, so fantastic to see. So, uh, I mean, Angelo, why is ICUS such an important show for Asher Abloy to come to? This show represents so many different people we talk to. When we define the customer, is the customer the security consultant? Mm. Is she the architect? Is she the building owner? certainly the security systems integrator or the enterprise software player and the, and the power of having that discussion with them yeah. about what's happening, what they see, what they feel, what their needs are, how do they see the ma macro and micro outlook, there's no better way to get it than here at this show. Absolutely. Uh, so can you tell me a little bit about some of the solutions that you're showcasing here? Yes, and I normally don't like to look at notes, but I did take a little <laughs> notepad because our, our marketing person, Laura, has so many new solutions we want to talk about, but we'll start with lockers, secure lockers from Luxor One, where you and I could receive a code, take a scan and go pick up our package rather than being left alone. I want to talk about the Centrio small business solution. This is software driving products for small to medium businesses. Dorbert Intelligent Intercoms, a company that we acquired from Germany. Very, very interesting. Securitech, who makes some of the most unusual and interesting security locking products that we know. And as I continue to look, data center security solutions, wireless access control, and unmanned infrastructure products as well. Uh, fantastic. So, um, can you tell me, thinking a little bit more broadly now, about some of the trends that we're seeing at the moment in access control and intelligent buildings? Yeah, and I think you'll hear this a lot. You'll hear this a lot, but you'll hear about artificial intelligence, and you'll hear about cybersecurity, and you'll hear about sustainability. Which, by the way, we do an ISC West breakfast for our community uh, tomorrow morning, and we're having five experts on these topics that we call megatrends. But if you think about it, all of us are hearing about artificial intelligence, we're hearing about cybersecurity, but we don't really know what it means for us in our business. Mm. We don't re really know what the practical application is. So we're going to put this panel together to help simplify it for the man or woman in the audience to say, this is what it means for me and my business. And of course, one other that I always feel compelled to ask is the move from keys and cards to mobile credentials. Fantastic. So what's next on the cards for Astro Abloy over the next 12 months? You got any exciting developments in the pipeline? Are you planning on expanding? So I wanted to talk about just a few new product releases that are quite interesting. And again, I want to take a quick, Absolutely. but we have a new EMI RFI shielding door and frame assembly, which is really unusual and unique that we have here. We have the ATS 9100 electric strike, which is for glass openings, which traditionally have been very, very difficult. Typically an eight hour install, this can cut it to one. We have the Medico Eclipse Spark Key that's so unusual, so unique. We're giving only sneak previews here. We're not even showing it in a display case. And we have the Securetron AQL power management. So a lot of new things on the product side. On the company side, what we continue to do is invest in people. And that is calling on end users, architects, security consultants, certainly the channel. And what we're trying to do is have dedicated teams that understand that space, that they can kind of live in that space, because that's where we get the feedback, the most raw feedback on what to develop, what to change, what to tweak. Not five minutes before you arrived, I had a major university client come up to me and Laura, offering some ideas and suggestions they had for a new product introduction we had. There's no better place to get it than here. Absolutely, I completely agree. Well, thank you so much. Angelo, it's been fantastic to speak with you. Great to see you, Victoria, thank you. Thank you.